Hello guys, welcome to this video to learn when and how to seal existing restorations, okay? Those restorations that are actually good, but they still have some voids, some gaps, and this is one of the tools that you have. So the first step would be to clean, rinse and dry the existing restoration, okay? And then we need to etch the adjacent enamel for 15 seconds with phosphoric acid. So here we are using the etching material from Ultradent. Please realize that we are using here relative isolation. You could, of course, use the rubber dam as well. So now rinsing the etching. Now, of course, we need to change these cotton rolls because we just washed the etching material. Now drying. And now we are going to apply the sealer. So that's the perma seal from Ultradent, and it actually seals the existing restorations. And after brushing the material on the surface of the restoration and the adjacent enamel, then we are going to thin dry and light cure this material. Here we are using the Valuex, a very nice um, light curing device from Ultradent. And then we need to check the occlusion. And that's it. But for class 5 restorations, then uh, the sealing reduces microleakages and that's proven by the literature. Okay? So uh, we, we are also showing a case of class 5 restoration which is being sealed here using this material as well, okay? I leave you guys watching the steps while you listen to this piano song that I composed. Hit your like button if you liked and then see you guys on the next videos.